Hey, Dr. Travis Whitney here with Innate Healthcare Institute. Got a great question in uh, about if stem cells or stem cell therapy can stop or reverse the aging process. So if you want to know more, stick around. So if anybody's uh, into anti-aging, longevity, but you'll probably eventually come across how stem cell or stem cell therapies play a key role. Uh, one of the biggest proponents and leaders in the field, uh, Dr. David Sinclair out of Harvard, um, has, been, has dedicated his career and life basically to uh, longevity, um, longevity medicine, finding out how we can age um, appropriately um, and, and age better to where our lifespan can increase, but not only our lifespan increasing by a number, but our health um, increasing and, and, and being better and improving as we live longer. So very much um, along the lines of what I tell my patients that it's not so much uh, the years in your life as it is the life in your, e your years. So we wanna know if, if stem cell therapy can be applied to anti-aging and longevity, and yes, it most certainly can. Uh, they did some fascinating research in, um, in a group of frailty aging patients to where they could no longer perform certain physical and mental tasks. Um, they gave them stem cell therapies, 100 million uh, stem cells intravenously. Uh, I believe they did it four times and tracked their progress over a course of a month. And lo and behold, at the end of, uh, at the end of when they were recording, uh, the, the, the time period, they all the participants were doing things physically and mentally significantly better than they were before the, uh, the stem cell treatment and a lot better than the placebo group that they compared them to. So one of the hallmark traits of aging, as, we, as we're defining aging, and I like Dr. Sinclair's um, analogy of, or not really analogy, but just uh, uh, comparing that uh, aging is a disease. And so we're finding out that as this disease of aging progresses, one of the hallmark traits is that we lose the amount of stem cells that are organically in our body, that are naturally uh, stored within us. Um, that's also one of my reasons why I wish we would use a lot more of umbilical cord stem cell medicine, which is my favorite kind to use, uh, because as we age, we're losing that store. As we get older, we're, our numbers of stem cells are decreasing, and so when you do something like a bone marrow or an adipose tissue, you don't have as rich of a store to pull from. You don't have as high of numbers to pull from. So um, as we lose these key healing cells in our body, we, don't age, or we age more and disease is easier uh, it just seems like we don't recover and recu recuperate. Uh, so stem cell therapy does and plays a very significant role in the aging process. And um, I use it in an uh, in, in anti-aging longevity capacity with patients. And we're seeing a lot of improvement in their physical and mental uh, uh, well-being. So you'll start to see and hear a lot more of it over the years. I can guarantee it. Um, so hope that clears things up and, and answers that question for you. And if you have any other questions regarding stem cells and aging or any kind of health related questions, leave them in the comments below. We'll make a video for it. And I'm wishing you all happy uh, and successful health and we'll see you in the next video.